Goddess Kring Radio. Shannon Kringen. Goddess Kring. Shannon Kringen. Goddess Kring. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take Goddess Kring away. This is Shannon Kring and Goddess Kring. Welcome to podcast. I think it's number 19 or is it number 20? It is February 23rd, 2017. Did I tell you guys that my breast needle biopsy was not needed? Um, they, I, I went in there. I was terrified. I was scared. They thought they might see something on my breast that needs to be biopsied. And to make a long story short, the doctor could not find the same spot uh, that the previous doctor found on my slide. So either my breast tissue changed or it was a mistake and there was just a shadow. But I went there for a mammogram, had to have a second mammogram, and then I had an ultrasound, and then that was three different times, and then I went and they didn't find anything of concern. So right now I am going to talk to a naturopath and make sure everything's okay with my breasts and I'm going to make sure that I'm healthy and I don't have any breast cancer in my family on either side. I did have breast reduction surgery in 1993 so scar tissue is definitely something that shows up on the mammograms and the slides and when I get you know palpated on my breast. There's definitely scar tissue texture going on. I also got frankincense oil, which is supposed to be medicinal. And some people say cancer fighting and some people say even cancer killing. uh, Although other people argue about that. But I will just say that as far as I know, I'm healthy right now. And I'm so relieved. And I'm so happy that my Obamacare covered all of what I just said. And I actually just got called in to model today suddenly in a bodysuit at an art school, which happens sometimes. I am a full-time freelance art model. So today's show might have to be some of my poetry because I have to get ready to go to my gig pretty soon. So let's just say that I am grateful to be alive and I have been moody and depressed lately but I have been eating well and going for walks and I am going to perform live on Monday February 27th at the Good Shepherd Center with Julie. It's a show called House of Julie and Goddess Kring me is one of the guests there's going to be music. Um, I should probably look at the Flyer, 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 Goddess Kring Podcast, Hollow Earth Radio, thank you for having me. Let's see, I'm looking for the flyer, House of Julie. The doorway to Norway is filled with delight. Julie sings the carefully curated selections she'll be doing it in Norway this July and reading from her forthcoming memoir, I Love Being Abroad. So um, it looks like Monday, February 27th, 7.30 to 9 p.m. at the chapel in the Good Shepherd Center, which is at 4649 Sunnyside Avenue North, 4th floor in Seattle. And Julie will be there as well as Carrie Wicks, Eric Apo, Char Easter, John Hansen, and me, Goddess Kring. So I will be doing some spoken word and then Julie will interview me briefly about this podcast and about my art projects and my traveling and my modeling and my being a naturist, etc. 
Julie's name is, I, and you know what? I don't know how to pronounce her name. I should have asked her because I've met her a few times and mostly seen her name. Julie Cassiopo, C-A-S-C-I-O-P-P-O, Julie Cassiopo. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but it, the show is called House of Julie. And Monday, February 27, 730 to 9 at the Good Shepherd Center here in Seattle. If you just go to my website, shannikringa.com, I have information about the show and I'm going to be there. Uh, so thank you for listening. What else was I going to say? I was maybe going to read some of my book. I self-published a book called Art, Identity, and the Sacred. It is now... February 23rd, 2017, and I'm doing this show at the last minute, and I just got called in to model, and I'm going to model later on today as well. So thank you for listening to Shannon Kring and Goddess Kring. So I am rather stressed out about political things happening in the world, and been feeling depressed and but been modeling a lot and need to do my income taxes have a lot of 1099s therefore have to pay my own taxes on all of that don't get a refund usually because only some of my modeling jobs are w4s and a lot of them are 1099s so i'm gonna have to get ready and do that i find tax time a bit stressful although now that my rent is lower I feel very fortunate and very lucky. And my cat continues to thrive on his raw food diet. I get him freeze-dried and frozen and air-dried raw meat cat food from the health food pet store. The vet thought he might be diabetic, but it turns out he's not, according to the tests that I keep giving him with his urine blood sugar level. And I'm really happy. His his pee and his poop is much better than it used to be. He used to drink vast amounts of water and pee huge amounts. They tested his kidneys and they seemed to be okay. They were just concerned about his blood sugar at the vet. So I now continue to feed him. I, I switched him cold turkey to the raw meat diet. And if you have a dog or a cat that has health issues like diabetes or irritable bowel syndrome or itchy, rashy skin or autoimmune disorder or any kind really of health uh, issue. I recommend checking out Dr. Karen Becker. She's a holistic vet online. She's a regular veterinary veterinarian, but she also specializes in um, proper nutrition for cats and dogs and she has really good information I um, used her videos to learn from she has videos on raw food diets for dogs and cats and how to do it right versus how to do it wrong and a lot of mainstream vets will not advise raw diet so you have to do it correctly or it can harm your pet I was lucky my cat switched a hundred percent over cold turkey so I feel so grateful that he was able to do that he acted as if it was normal when I switched him and he immediately within two days of starting the raw food diet raw meat he stopped drinking tons of water and stopped peeing huge amounts of pee now he mostly gets his liquid I have water out for him all the time but he rarely drinks out of it he mostly just drinks um, his food I feed him frozen and freeze-dried raw meat and I mix it with water and mush it up and turn it into kind of a soup for him, like a gravy, thick gravy soup kind of food. And he drinks it basically and that's where he gets his water. Plus the frozen raw meat diet is very moist and has lots of moisture in it. So he seems to get all the liquid he needs from that. As well as... His poop has changed. He used to have a lot of really stinky diarrhea type poop and, you know, large amounts of it. And now that he eats raw meat diet, his poo is like dark brown, usually maybe lighter brown. And it's just cute little poo logs of um, firm, not too firm and not too soft, you know, fairly relatively firm. And it doesn't really smell very bad. It definitely stinks like poop, but it's not putrid and acidic. It smells just like healthy poo 
as far as I can tell. So, and it, it gets firm really quick. So I'm pretty sure that he's very healthy. His fur seems shinier and smoother and he's running around and playing a lot. And the look in his eye, he looks more happy and comfortable. He had a look in his eye previously when he was having issues. He looked a little distressed and uncomfortable and now he looks more peaceful. So that's my feeling on that. So Dr. Karen Becker <coughs> is a vet online who has YouTube videos that I watched, many of them. So check that out if you want um, to improve the nutrition of your dog or cat. And it is more expensive to feed them raw meat diets, although you can make your own recipe as well, which is less expensive. And in the long run, I think it's less expensive to feed him healthy food like that because I'll have to take him to the vet less often, which is very expensive. You know how vets are very expensive. And he's happier and healthier and he doesn't waste any of his food. Another thing I like about raw meat diet for my cat is that he eats pretty small portions. I feed him a few times a day, very small portions. I don't feed him any dry food anymore at all. So I just feed him a few times a day and then I have these air dried raw meat snacks that I give him as, you know, as a snack. And I also get raw frozen chicken hearts from one of the health food pet stores. They sell them and only then they're only three dollars a pound. Uh, so I get a big, a big bag of frozen chicken hearts and I just feed no more than three a day because I guess they're high in sodium, uh, but they're full of taurine and good minerals for my cat and it's good for his eyesight so he loves his raw chicken hearts and I slice them up into little pieces and he eats them I feel sad for all the animals that get slaughtered you know to feed us and and um, cats and dogs but I'm so happy that my cat is healthy now and I see him he's looking out the window right now he looks really happy he's looking at the birds and so there it is goddess kring shannon kringen february 23rd 2017 what else? The Seattle Public Library is having some of the Claxton Kent Goddess Kring music. Uh, I still haven't gotten final confirmation that it's that it's available yet, but it's seattlepubliclibrary.org slash playback. And if you're a local Seattle musician, they might still be looking for music. I'm not sure. So you can apply to, for that for free. There's an album that Claxton Kent and I did a few years ago called Sing Kringnicity. And I put that in their collection at the library. So I'm excited about that. And now here's some poetry. Shannon Kring and Goddess Kring. Thanks for tuning in to Hollow Earth Radio Goddess Kring podcast. I also archive this show every week on Mixcloud, Bandcamp, and Patreon, as well as my YouTube channel. Shannon Kringen is my YouTube channel. S-H-A-N-N-O-N-K-R-I-N-G-E-N -N -N -E is my YouTube channel, and I put my visual art, my photographs, as the visual slideshow, and you can listen to the same podcast. So thank you for joining me. Donald Trump, Donald your Trump, fire. fire. Donald Trump, your fire. Donald Trump, your fire. Bernie Sanders, you're higher. You're higher. Bernie Sanders, you're higher. You're higher. Bernie Sanders, you're higher. Goddess Cream, Shannon, Shannon Cream, Radio, Radio, Radio Podcast, Hollow Earth Radio, Hollow Earth Radio, Three Times Cinnamon, Minty Green, Cleansing Clean, Dreaming Big. Mamo squish. squish, healing delicious, nutrition, no longer superstitious, Tom Petty, Petty. widens my jetty, my jetty, times one, two, three, three. 
Times, times, cinnamon, cinnamon, two, two, one, two, one, one, focus, focus, energy, energy, synergy, synergy, frankincense, 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 infused, tohoba, tohoba, oil, oil, coconut, coconut, oil, oil, rub a dub dub healing underneath 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 ultrasound slide shadow shadow needle biopsy shadow vanish shadow projection 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 Tender, painful Tender, tissue. Painful we, tissue. All, we all, we all have a golden ticket. A golden ticket in, a golden one way, ticket. in one way or another. Or another. We all, we all have a golden all, ticket. A golden ticket in one way or another. Or another. Massage. Massage. Healing vibrational frequencies into me. See. Into me, see. Clearing emotional baggage, baggage, clutter, clutter. Open the shutters. Let the storm pass through. Let the storm pass through. Blow the temple clean. Blow the temple clean. Open. Open the space. Open space. Open space. Scar tissue change. Scar tissue change. Age arranging. 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 Texture. Texture. Feel the energy. Feel the energy. Sonic shape sculptures. Sculptures. Thank you. Thank you. Tori Amos. Tori Amos. Tom Petty. Tom Petty. All the sound sculptors. Sculptors. Arranging sonic space. Solid lyric, solid lyric, melody making, melody making, earthquake shaking, row twenty one, row twenty one, B, section B, honey B, honey B, honey B, Tom, Tom, Petty, Wide, Petty, Wide, Jetty, Jetty, Tom, Tom, Petty, Tom, Petty, Tom, Petty, Widen, Widen. My jetty, 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 square in the middle, square in the middle of sonic of space, sonic of space, sonic three D structures, structures, solid, solid as Hunderwasser House, Hunderwasser House, Hunderwasser House, Hunderwasser House, inspirited, inspirit, inspiration, inspirited, inspirit, inspiration. Inspiration, bending notes and lines, winding down rows of vines. Close your eyes, cause we're going to the land of Alice. In this palace, in this palace. Drink from the chalice, from the chalice, from the chalice. Wishing no malice, wish malice, fallacy, fallacy, fail to see, fail to see, fallacy, fallacy, fail to see, fail to see. Synchronicity, dancing serendipity, diatomaceous earth. Soaking in silica, mineral rich, mineral rich, mineral rich, cleansing fossils. Felt the fear, felt the fear, felt the steering clear of death, of Shannon, Shannon, steering clear of death, Shannon, be planning, planning. Stick around, stick around till 2068. 20 a hundred years on earth, on earth. Diverted on earth. road, road. Loaded with loaded thorns, with thorns and, and thrown. 
drones, drones and loans. Drones and loans. Here now, here now, in the present, in the present, in present, 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 bow down to love, bow up to love, non duality, two sides, one coin, two sides, one coin. Unwind, Unwind lines of time. Of time. Of time. Of time. Drive the mind. Drive the mind. Drive the mind. Glide the Glide the fine. Guide the tide. Feel the blue. Feel the blue. Taste the orange. Taste the orange. Feel the blue. Feel the blue. Taste the orange. Taste the orange. Non non duality. duality. Two sides, one coin. Unwind lines of time. Drive the mind. Glide the fine. Guide the time. Feel the blue, feel the blue. Feel the taste, blue. The taste the orange, the swirling, curling, curling, swirling, curling, curling, chaos, chaos, leads to this, to this, to this. Shannon Kringen, Goddess Cream, February 2017. Thanks for tuning in Thanks to tuning my in podcast, to my Hollow Earth Radio. Thank you. Shannon Kringen, Goddess Cream, Tom Petty, widens my jetty. Donald Trump, Trump, you are fire, you are fire, fire Bernie, Bernie Sanders, Sanders, you are higher. Sending you all love, you all love, you all love. Be yourself, no matter what they say. Shut the old door and 
open the new door now. Crumple still skin. Crumple still skin. Amazed at the orange mont. Crumple still skin. Stripe there. Volt this. Volty rinsing it off. Undulate morph melded. Zoom away. Zoom away. Crumple still
me, many me's, evoking seas, vice set me free, rocking the paradox, unlocking authenticity, dancing in this sing creamnicity intertwined unwinding lines of time holding back a void dance tuning in the tracks of what I seem to stack persistently resisting a full life embrace 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 Embracing this space, not running away. Insight lights the way, despite fear, enjoying tantric kissing. Fishing dark water self, searching through deep doubt, sailing with the bright star. You are, you are, you are. Power tripper, soul ripper, cookie dough, doorknob, spin. Freeze where you end up, bracket back early. Self-indulgent, overrate, underrate. It's all a beauty contest. Their ego wounds haunt me, taunt me. Dare me to express outward. Shadows lit up, on and on, circling up. Bloodlines of DNA melt this away. Cracked branch ready to launch. Passionate lunch. Hunky dory. Crunchy munchy. You teach me, ancestors. I honor you. I choose you to show me. Plant me. Stand with me. I love and forgive you. Me, we. Lightning seed of green, eyes on rising steam. Healing really does reveal the dreams. Authentic ejaculation of my soul, molten orange liquid glow. Let this truth show, rooted in youth glow. Beginner's mind, loving the tide lines. It should be fashion to be, honey, be passionate. Off that tower with the flowers. Bittersweet, but mostly sweet. Nectar life. All worth this path. A road less traveled. Embrace. Cut a little doubt in this drought of passion. Now with big, big yummy honey dripping. Intrigue to sensuality. Spirituality. Duality. Non-duality, exploring all aspects. Eucalyptus sent the wind, eucalyptus sent me back. Let that big wheel go, anger takes its toll. Power cancer bush pricks my big toe, being rolled on that metal shelf, feeling much stamina I have. Growing in the knowing, show in the loving. Embracing grace, moonshone face. Intimacy chasing me, feel like it's erasing me, but no. Intimacy spacing me, now know it's loving me. Tecolote Canyon, Shen, Shen Diego. Honoring clarity, exploring rarity. Seeing it's useless to be defensive. Always trying to prove it. Better to be moved by it. Knowing inspiration is the station I want to be in. Limelight enjoying solitude and deep sea diving. Saving silence and soul speak. Introverted extrovert is I. Daring to share. Circle soul try. No one bribe. Freedom to choose, not there to lose, but sure, healing the blues wound. Paradox through the door, a group for loners and they all showed up. I must confess that, yes, I bless this mess. Fertile luck, lessons, soul, uniting lightning. 
have integrated the carrot, capiche? She dances in a moonlit stack of thunder light, inviting those of you wanting this belonging. Shannon Kringen, Goddess Cream, 2010. Goddess Kring Radio, Goddess Kring, Goddess Kring, Shannon Goddess Kring, 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 Goddess Kring. Thanks for tuning in. This is Shannon Kring and Goddess Kring. It's February 23rd, 2017, and I got to take off to a modeling gig, so I'm making a funky mix for you. Next, enjoy poetry and music. All of this is poetry and music by me. Uh, here's me on the piano and my friend on guitar. Check it out. Goddess Kring podcast number 19. Thanks for tuning in. Thank you, Hollow Earth Radio, for hosting me. music I see shapes and they move and when I have been physical with a man that I feel a deep connection with sexually as well as emotionally and spiritually and mentally all the different levels I feel like we're dancing and he's he's got his energy I have my energy and then when you combine me and this other person together we create a, a third energy like a new energy and it's a space that we're creating together the, the male and the female me and the man and it, I guess that's kind of what Tantra is and it's like you're dancing with your energy and you respond to his energy and he responds to your energy and that's what this woman last night when I did the reading had her do a reading for me she was saying that I need to find someone that evokes a response from me 
because it's true in the past I've sometimes chased after men that weren't really um, they well maybe they wanted to have sex with me but they weren't really there in all the other ways and so it's like I want to find somebody that's that's passionate that and in order to do that I, I know I need to be more passionate myself and love myself and really come forth and shine my light and so she suggested I dance that I go to like open dance sessions or dance classes and just dance and dance with men and or dance with myself with other people but dance and just move and dance and enjoy the energy of my body other people's bodies and just see what it feels like to be kind of a sensual dancing person um, but not rush into sleeping with anybody you know and because I think I do need to take a break from really getting involved with somebody sexually although I really want to find a wonderful lover um, but I might not be ready because I just got out of I just a two-year relationship I was in ended and it was kind of sad but I think it's all for the better I don't want to go into the details but um, I do want to eventually have another relationship in my life but I really want to be more conscious this time of making sure that I connect with whoever it is I'm going to be involved with monogamously um, body mind heart and soul instead of just one or the other um, so I think dance is one of the ways in which to do that and to just have dinner with people and like you know just have dinner walk and talk and share but not rush into getting involved with anybody and luckily I'm not really that attracted to very many people I'm kind of picky so you know the lightning bolt thing has only happened to me about four times in my life and every time it happens I think wow this is probably never gonna happen again and then it happens again so I know it can happen and I'm hoping next time I feel a lightning bolt um, connection with with a man a beautiful man I'm hoping that it can be body mind heart and soul because it tends to be mostly body <laughs> when that lightning bolt thing hits it's like a kind of a spiritual and a sexual thing but maybe the emotion and the mental is not fully there um, so I need to become more available to myself on all those levels and radiate that out so that I can attract like a magnet I can attract a man that's equal to me and that's not freaked out by the nudity and not freaked out by my sexuality and not freaked out by me but actually attracted to that and inspired by it in his own whatever his own thing is so this is Shannon Kringen you're watching Goddess Kreen thanks for tuning in Spiral drive. Bada boo, bada bing, stinging rings the crane. Catch the winds on spiral drive. Crack the code left and right, no. Solving the can of worms on my own. Smoky hands, rough and cracked. Take the sand and stand alone, all one. I present the present. Desert the desert. Exercise, bring exorcism. Cleanse, cleanse. Illusion to erosion, erosion by explosion to explosion. Fusion drives illusion to erosion, erosion guides fusion to explosion. No thanks to the tanks of skank. I reject the neglect. Funnel cloud dancing loud. I want to be the center of attention. I want to be the center of attention. Pretension of invention.
straining to contain the demon. Straining, straining to contain the demon. Straining to contain the demon. Fusion draws illusion to illusion. Erosion guides fusion to explain. Winds on spiral drive. Winds on spiral drive. Winds on spiral drive.
whistles tagging, amber melts the sand, waiting rugs tilting lens, green peach skin, swirling marble. Stay away from beige, beige, you say. beige you say. embrace shadow we may, sweeping brooms, sweeping brooms. Sweeping brooms. opals moon, justify solitude, just to fight, just to fight, just to dismissive ability, not casual yet professional. Thank you for listening to Shannon Kring and Goddess Kring podcast number 19. Again, it's February 23rd, 2017. Got a dash off to a modeling gig in a bodysuit. Got a sudden call. So I splish splashed and splish and spliced and fastened together and Jimmy rigged this thingy Mick Jagger show. So enjoy the gray sky. And um, I got Tom Petty tickets. My dad is treating me. Tom Petty is coming to Seattle August 19th, 2017 to Safeco Field. They've never performed there before. That's a huge venue for them. Usually they go to the Gorge and it's really hard to get to. So I'm really, really, really happy that my dad and I get to go see Tom Petty together. Tom Petty widens my jetty is something I've been saying for like 20 years. Um, I first heard Tom Petty refugee on a jukebox in a pizza parlor on Whidbey Island and I was missing California and I heard that song and I ran to the jukebox and was like, oh my God, what is this? And that was before I even saw what Tom Petty looked like. I just love the sound of the music and the guitar and the lyrics and just the energy and the anger. And I love Tom Petty because he's in touch with his feminine side. He's got the masculine and the feminine, the inima and the animus. And he has, he symbolizes to me that I'm going to be okay and that I can heal and recover from my mom abruptly taking me away from California when I was nine years old, away from my dad and grandparents and, and uncles and my school and my friends and the ocean and the sunshine. And then we took off to Woodby Island to live as hippies kind of. So uh, it was just really traumatic for me. And so when I heard Tom Petty, it just made me feel so much better. And then he just became the symbol because he looked like the grown up version of little boys I used to chase on the playground as a little kid in San Diego. So Tom Petty is, is very uh, symbolic to me of following my dreams, following my heart, being strong. I know a lot of his song lyrics fit in with that, but some of my favorite Tom Petty songs are not the hits. There are songs like A Face in the Crowd, Luna, Shadow People, um, Power Drunk, some of his newer songs, some of his Mud Crutch songs, Scare Easy, Hungry No More, etc. There's so many good songs, Luna, Magnolia, some of the older Tom Petty and the Heartbreaker songs. There's just, he's angry, he's romantic, he's rebellious, and yet he's kind and, and he's sort of feminine and sort of masculine, and he's just so handsome. I just really think he's so handsome. So there it is. So... I have a huge crush on him, and I love his music. I love the lyrics, the melody, very strong melodies. Him and Tori Amos both create amazingly strong melodies. So thank you for tuning in. I'll see you next week. This is podcast number 19. Wow, next next week will be number 20. So remember, I'm performing at the Good Shepherd Center in Seattle, 7.30 to 9 p.m. with House of Julie. Uh, at the Good Shepherd Center, February Monday, February 27th, 7.30 to 9 p.m. in Seattle. And the Seattle Public Library has some of my music, Synchronicity, Synchronicity, Synchronicity. So thank you for enjoying my show. I hope you did. Please ask me any questions or comments. And get a mic and audacity and do your own podcast if you're so inclined. Follow your bliss. Bada boo, bada bing, stinging rings, the cring, catch the wind song, spiral drive, crack the code, left and right mode. Goddess Kring Radio, Shannon Kringen, Goddess Kring, Shannon Kringen, Goddess Kring. This show has been digitized to hide my obscene body parts. And not a threat, and not a threat, and not a threat. That is crazy.
come to life. Natural human form is beautiful and needs to be shared in more diverse ways. Most of the fame I have achieved is due to the controversy of me sharing my naked body on the TV screen. The media is full of violence and destruction, but skin is hidden away in shame. I model nude for art classes, not rude, not crude. Art classes where the human body is still appreciated as beauty, 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 beauty. Goddess Kring Radio, Shannon Kringen, Goddess Kring, Shannon Kringen, Goddess Kring.